All right, so I completed my patio project, but I need to put a cover over it because of the grass. Now, and it kind of make it even. Right? Well, that's six by six, right? Or a little bit off, maybe a few. Like half a quart, quarter of an inch, maybe, right? So it's probably what? Six, five and a quarter, three quarters by five and three quarters, right? But the pool, the spa, and again, I'm going to start cleaning the pools with algae and bleach, right? Right, right. You see that there? Is the algae cleaner and again it's gonna clear out the algae first right and then scrub with a broom right the inside of the pool mm -hmm. now you're like oh well the size of the pool is like the uh, with a kiddie pool cuz I'm again not able to get a pool spa <laughs> Because it cost between eighteen to thirty thousand dollars for one. <laughs> right. Guess how much all this cost me? Plus mm -hmm, the spot itself, right? Less than a thousand dollars. Yeah. <laughs> now this ain't because I will or will not have kids in the future either. Even if I did, right? Even if I don't. What it is for is recreational use. Right? So I can exercise and do my karate in a light, <laughs> watery environment. Now they also suggest if you're going to have a baby, you know, one of the best things to have it in is water. <laughs> <laughs> Because water is buoyant. Water is easier for the baby to uh, transfer from a watery substance to a watery substance and then to air. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> and like I said, right. See, I got to do something about the grass here. And when I put on the um, thing, I didn't cut the grass along that edge, right? Use the shovel there, right? Up the ear, right? Now, when I cut the grass with the more, right? See, this area here will be having the blah, right? Not done, right? And this area here will be for swimming, and this area here for swimming. But that's going to be, you know, for exercise purposes there, right? <laughs> And see, there's my karate guy still in my thing. <laughs> and that one's only 70 pounds. Why? Because I can't throw a grown man? Yeah, technically, no. <laughs> no way. But, <laughs> if in emergency, right, <laughs> I have to defend myself against a grown man, you don't use a dummy like that to fight somebody. <laughs> You use a dummy like that because it's only 70 pounds. I know. Why do you do like maybe a little bit more than a third of a man's weight, right? Because throwing techniques are about leverage. It's not always about mm -hmm, height or weight. Mm -hmm. Now, you also heard the old adage, the bigger they are, the harder they fall, right? You're basically doing tripping techniques, right? You're trying to trip the man with your little feet <laughs> because he has big clumsy feet. <laughs> Technically. <laughs> and you're trying to get him down, right? Right. <laughs> exactly. <clears throat> Now, you can already see an improvement in the algae in this pool because I poured, like, half the algae cleaner in this pool and half in that pool, right? 
But you can really tell in this pool. <laughs> now, another thing you can use is bleach or, and things of that nature. I also got a wasp nest that they built and, uh, under the mm -hmm, stair. And see, one of them is just the hell if I need to change the bag or whatever, right? Outside, right? Because I also got another bag, right? I might can use eventually, right? Now, the thing is, I got to buy a new, um, uh, whatever they call them. <laughs> I forget right now, I'm brain farting. <laughs> Another uh, boxing thing that goes pata tata tata. <laughs> what do they call this? I forget. <clears throat> uh, I know they got some kind of name for it too, right? I just ain't, don't remember it. <laughs> but, uh, well, it, it's a punching thing, but it's, it's not a punching bag, it's a punching. Uh, speed bag, speed, speed, speed bag, right? So like that. Mm hmm. All right. Yeah. Mm hmm. Now this little thing was for that big umbrella. Mm hmm. But it just flew the umbrella all over the yard, right? Even though I filled, filled it with sand, right? That's too small. But the one over there is metallic, and it seems to be holding out better. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Right, right. And this is just kind of my plan for my backyard. Now, I'm going to work on the grass. I might even put brick, right, all around that, right, later on, right, so that once I get my grass established from my workout area, I can have kind of both, right, the workout area and the grass around it, right, Still, mm -hmm. right, right. But then again, I won't have as much yard right, that has grass for right, to exercise in versus versus right. mm -hmm. to cut. Mm -hmm. I, I have the yes, that's your yard to cut, right? But I still can get back here and use a little bit more in. Uh, mm -hmm driving more right now i don't know if i need to cut it again for the winter or if the winter will take care of the grass <laughs> again you might can cut it one more time but once the vibber gets here the grass will just kind of do away with itself you, you ain't really got to cut it again unless you just want to right but i can do that too right well that's why i built the fence the privacy fence, right? So I can do what I need to do. This ain't about my children or your children only, but what I need to do to rehabilitate myself for my injury, which I've been rehabilitating myself from since it happened in 94, right? Now, sometimes I'm better with it <laughs> and can do more during the day. <laughs> but sometimes I luck, can't, can't. And I have to lay down more during the day. Here, Froggy, he went to court and he did right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Froggy went to court and he did right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 